Could you do me a favor, Josh? Could you say congratulations? You've won a free iPhone 6. That's so awesome that my microphone's the worst thing ever and never works. Can you, I love can that. You, hey, Josh, could you say what he's, he wanted you to say? Congratulations. You've won a free iPhone 6. <laughs> Click here to win. Click here to download. <laughs> Can you, can you go click, 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 hey click Hey guys, I'm, uh, I'm on my way back from my uh, truck route. I'm a trucker. Uh, I'm talking to my trucker radio. Um, hey, uh, big dog, this is a uh, little guy. I'm here to meet you in the men's room at the rest stop. Uh, tell me if you want to hang out. I have um, many diseases I have not yet been identified. I just like to spend my time on the the open road. That's all. That's all I want to do in my life is is drive around with you, big dog, big dog. Please, if you get this message, respond, please. I'm not gonna fix my microphone. We're gonna have this for the rest of the stream. Oh, no. <laughs> Sorry, Pepe, you just locked in. You would not believe your eyes. You would not believe your eyes if 10 million fireflies if so, uh, lit up the world as you fell asleep. Uh, cause they feel the open air. Can you wait? Wait, what, two something. seconds? Okay, go now. My brother just came in and told me to shut up. <laughs> stare! Just stand and stare. I'm looking to buy, so I go to the store, and I and I want to buy another brand of cereal, but there are only four brands of cereal. There is Kellogg's, there is General Mills, and the other two brands of cereal. And I I am here to tell you about my experiences there's the kroger brand i don't like the kroger brand it, i know it tastes the same but i feel like they do something to it to make it cheaper i doubt it's real food um please don't leave please don't leave please don't leave dude i, I this is my first gig that i've ever gotten dude come on please don't go please don't go i i'm trying so hard man i try so hard i try so hard for you i try so hard for you See Carson. Carson wasn't actually losing. He wasn't. He wasn't leaving. Sorry, not losing. Uh, he wasn't leaving because he thought I wasn't being funny. Um, he was leaving because he he was he was using it as an excuse to to use the bathroom or something. And so I'm um he but he he did it to insult me as well. But you see, I'm funny. Uh, they call me funny man because uh, I tell jokes. They call me Mr. Funny Man. Um, I have a Twitch channel. Uh, and a YouTube channel. You should subscribe and follow that, those because I'm funny, uh, and I tell jokes on those streams. I'm I make I'm like I'm they call the um you can call the the best of Carson video best of Josh because look at me, they call me man of the hour because I'm a, I'm the man of the hour, and however many minutes long this video is. Um, basically, I um am not being paid. Uh, at my job as an intern at the Kroger and I need the money to pay for my daughter to go to college. Uh, she's dead. She hasn't been bored yet as I don't have a, a have a mate. Um, but you know, just, just, it's, it's called, um, it's called uh, preparing for the future, which is what I'm doing right now on, on stream by streaming on Twitch. I'm looking for a, a, a mate of preferably of the female gender within the age range of 18 to 20 years old. Um, and I, I'm looking for a soulmate. I'm looking for any woman's love or affection. Nothing, nothing, nothing brings me joy anymore. And I believe the cure all to be the, 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 the warm embrace of a woman. Please, I'm so desperate. <laughs> you missed the ride, Carson. I'm sure I did. I got up knowing that I would. Dude, you started the cereal thing and I left. <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't stopped. Of course he hasn't.
Anyway, uh, chat, let's get back to business. I'm looking for a... <laughs> They're playing Minecraft oh, bride to be. it's just going to look like I'm... Dude, he was still talking. Statue. A statue. <laughs> I hate him so much. I hate him. I hate him so much, chat. Wait, wait, wait. I just need the, lo I just need the lovable woman. <laughs> Sad. I'm such a sad, unbelievably sad person, and I need love in my life, um, particularly that of a female um, who has um, amiable features, um, well put together structure, um, and a whole lot of heart, and a an affinity for video games. I just want a gamer bride, preferably one that's uh, that's partnered on Twitch, and is verified on Twitter. So I, you know, you, you get like the full package. Um, I want her to wear nothing but swimsuits, um, men's uh, like like 1930s men's swimsuits, where they're like black and white stripes all the way up and down, and I want her to marry me the day I meet her in Las Vegas, California. And we're going to go to the place and Elvis is going to be the person, the, the guy who gives me my wedding license. My, 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 my bride will be beautiful in her 1930s men's swimsuit. Uh, she's going to be in also one of those 1930s, uh, like changing tents that are also on the beach. Um, and there's going to be one of those swimsuit cops as well to make sure her swimsuit is the appropriate length as to not uh, draw the eyes of an, un, any uh, unwanted parties, uh, especially the Elvis Presley that's going to be getting us hitched. Um, I'm just looking. <laughs> so that's my, um, those are my, that's my ultimatum. Uh, if I don't get that uh, within the allotted time of three months, uh, I'm going to, uh, stop everything <laughs> until I get what I so desire. Please, 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 what does that mean? please, what does that mean? any women out there who fit the description I have so graciously provided, um, message me on Instagram. I'll be sure to respond if you are hot if you're not hot um uh i'm sorry i don't know what to tell you you'll you'll know you'll know if you're not but anyway i don't think there's that's anyone me. that fits your description i'm looking for a woman of with a strong foundation of concrete and rebar <laughs> and like 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 a like a like a stone i need a rock I need a, I need a breadwinner, but it needs I need a lady who will who will carry me up the stairs and tuck me in the bed, and is t between the age of eighteen to twenty years old and is attractive to my personal specifications. I just want I just want a high five and a slap on the ass from my beautiful bride to be. And then I will, she can have uh, all the money and all the cars Me and Andrew, all the with house. That mouth, dude, Josh, I need a rock. I need a breadwinner. I need a lady who will carry me up the stairs and tuck me in the bed and who is between the age of 18 and 20. I'm just looking for a, the love of my life. I'm going to put an ad in the classifieds. I'm going to make, I'm going to make, a, I'm going to make a Craigslist post. I'm going to be, I'm going to, the ad's going to read, looking for a structurally superfluous. So sweaty. It's going to be like, dude, Ninja, uh, should we? <laughs> no. 
Uh, the, the stock market has crashed. The world is coming to an end. <laughs> oh, the... oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, God. The game. It's starting. It's okay. That wasn't. Um, in case you didn't know, the Star Wars films are actually based off of the time period of the 1940s, uh, late 1930s, late 19 mid to mid 1940s. And the Star Wars films have, so like, because, like, the Stormtroopers, uh... <laughs> Real. Dude, you were the first to go. Get the fuck get out of here. here. Yeah, you like cock and balls and maybe dick. Uh, saga, the National Treasure Saga with, with, um, Nicolas Cage as the main character whose name I can't remember is, I think it was Benjamin. It's so inappropriate, bro. I'm live on Twitch. Strength. I need a woman to hold me. <laughs> and I, I'm so desperate. Uh... Uh, very comprehensively directed, but I have not seen the second National Treasure. <laughs> the dark nature of the Harry Potter films after the first two. But um, point is, I, she can't be into the Harry Potter films. Uh, she has to like the National Treasure film. Uh, no. Not seen the film in quite some time. Uh, so I'm not a fan of the vacuum cleaner character. Living Toaster's not that great of a plot device. Um, but what can you say? Uh, the, but the, the vacuum cleaner scary. Uh, there was the lamp character. There was the blanket character. Um, I think the blanket character was supposed to be like an electric blanket, because um, it had like a like a dial on it. Uh, I like the blanket character. The blanket character is really wholesome. Um, and then there's also um, the toaster character, I, which I again I I thought was a very cool plot device when I was little. But now that I am uh, at the ripe old age of 36, I gotta say it's not a very good plot device. Down and critique the brave little toaster with me. That's all I want in a woman. <laughs> uh, <can laughs> it's screenshot time. Dude, I've got screenshots with all of my favorite Minecraft YouTubers. Too into the. I'm not too into the Dutch. I don't like the Belgians. They did. Ah, oh man. The Benny. The whole Benny Lux region in general is kind of weak. Um. That none of them have like their own like culture or anything. It's like kind of like discount Germany, uh, right across the channel from the UK. I guess that's pretty cool. Uh. But the. Uh. So. But Belgium. It's like half French and half Dutch. I don't even understand. <laughs> I don't know how this keeps going. I don't know how he keeps... He does this sometimes, by the way. He's really good at doing this. The mix here is I'm also just unmuting. And, he, and that, something about that. I mean, I bet he could even be on a different topic now. I, there's no telling. I mean, they barely even have any in California, for it, gonna be honest. The Burger King franchise, um, it's not like... I, you think it, there'd be more of them? I've I've seen like maybe one and it was attached to a Walmart. I don't know where you even find them. I don't know if it's like a Midwest or East Coast franchise. <laughs> it's a it is very important for it to be of the age of eighteen to twenty years old. Uh, that is probably the one of the number one features that is required. Um, but she also has to be very sh well off financially, so that way, if Twitch collapses in on itself, uh, I don't have to go back to work. 
<laughs> and it's not ninja. I killed Mr. Beast. This is the worst moment of my life. That's so like B grade. I do. I'm not quite sure. Um, but you know, there's got to be some way to to summon such a like an, an ethereal being. Um, that is um simple for the every man to do because obviously many people have done it. Uh, I've seen a lot of people with girlfriends, and I just I just don't know. I don't know how they do it. I don't understand. But um anyway, my ad is out there. You can hit me up on the. Uh... <laughs> oh, are you kidding me? Mick was no longer in the Rocky franchise. Um, I think it was after Rocky too. Um, but I can't be too certain. Like he could have been in Rocky. I haven't seen Rocky three. Um, he could be. I know Mr. T's in Rocky three. Uh, but that's really it. I know that Rocky is like, oh, I'm hot shit, and he um gets his act his ass kicked by Mr. T, uh, who's in the the the. He's not in G.I. Joe. He's in the A-Team, which is another uh, media franchise I've never seen. And I'm I'm not sure if it's good. I don't know, really know anything about it. Um, I don't know I don't know a lot about 80s media. I know that uh, Ghostbusters was... They're going to hit me with their axes and... Uh, same time I unsubscribed from all the political channels because like I um I used to watch the uh, the uh, What's his what's his name? The uh, Doug Walker uh, uh, What's his name? Uh, the nostalgia critic uh, when I was when I was uh, in probably the first year of high school I thought I could kill them. So in the one episode of the Nostalgia Critic, um, he what, what which one was I on talking that. about? On... Uh, Dash, sorry, Dash, um, Dash, uh, unmuted and, and made me lose my train of thought oh. for a minute. I can't remember which episode of the Nostalgia Critic I was talking about. Um, but okay, so there's a lot of episodes. There's the one where. <laughs> oh gosh, I hate the misfits. I hate. Them. Oh gosh. Single crack of the, the official version of Minecraft Pocket Edition on my Kindle Fire, uh, but I would watch from basically from the years of 2009 to 2010. I would watch the Angry Video Game Nerd, and then one time I got in trouble because my parents walked in, and then they had uh, they had me sit down and watch an episode of the of the Angry Video Game Nerd with them, uh, which was probably one of the worst experiences of my entire life. And uh, I regret uh, every day, and I I remember it so vividly. Uh, it's it's like a mental scar. And I was I was only around nine years old at the time. I was um I was in the third grade, and like I like that's like that's like a repressed memory. That was re that was a really bad time. But yeah, I really liked the angry video game nerd. I thought I'd revisit him. Saw the collab with the uh, what's his face uh, with Doug Walker. And I watched a Quentin Reviews video on Doug Walker, and I was like, oh, man, Doug Walker. Uh, he's not a great guy. And so I, you know, but I I hadn't watched Doug Walker for a while up until that point. Um, but Doug Walker did a lot of reviews. <laughs> is this a filibuster? It is. He's doing a filibuster. Josh has a lot of practice. No, I wouldn't. But maybe Josh would. Let's see what he's thinking. Economy. Uh, so that what happened with uh, social Darwinism in the 1800s uh, was you had uh, the big uh, corporations like the Standard Oil Company, uh, which would uh, see themselves as like the, the pinnacle of uh, that specific industry which they, uh, which they occupied. Uh, so they would see themselves as the superior um, the superior force in the in the market, and it would they they'd see that as their reason for swallowing up smaller businesses. So so like for example, what John D. Rockefeller would do, uh, John D. Rockefeller would uh, offer to buy a an, an oil, like an independent oil refinery for a for a you know not a great amount of money, or or a good amount of money depending on who it was. But that person might not want to cave. So people are like, 
oh, well, he's like, well, okay. And he just lowers the price to oil to where everyone's taking it out of the loss. But the thing about the Standard Oil Company was because it owned 90% of the oil refining uh, industry, um, he was able to take that loss uh, for the amount of time that he was doing it, just long enough for the um, the business he was trying to take uh, for let's say a couple million uh, to like fail completely and flop um, and so then he'd buy that business for maybe a, a few thousand dollars uh, so that's um, that's that's how John D. Rockefeller did that but uh, so I was talking about social Darwinism I was talking about the um, uh, the the uh, rant era of YouTube uh, so I was talking about like people come out on top. Leafy uh, was one of those like was one of those businesses, you know, got bought out by the Standard Oil Company. You know, that would be H three H three in this specific situation, which is very strange considering H uh, three's political philosophy and his support of someone like Andrew Yang. Now let's talk about Andrew Yang. <laughs> That's a mute for me. He's, he's gonna start talking about oh Andrew Yang's gonna give a thousand dollars. Participate in. I, I love I I buy a lot of uh, DLC for games during the Steam Summer Sale, and uh, having a thousand dollars would make it much easier to buy more things on. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. It took a second. The screen here is great. I have 10 million diamond play buttons. To... <laughs> <laughs> want this car. I want this car so bad, but that bike is so much cheaper. Which one are you going to take? Are you going to take the bike or the car? You're going to take the uh, you're going to take the bike. So that's why I'm saying like you during the steam sales, you always buy worse products not because um, simply because they're cheaper, they're the cheaper option. You 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 could buy the Lamborghini, but the Lamborghini's not on sale because guess who put that on the store? It was like the guys who do like the like two K who doesn't do anything during the Steam sales. You got you, so you buy like a game like Bye Bye Wacky Planet, which is the game in my Steam library. That I... <laughs> All right, there's good. Let's check on uh, Josh. Sim City Four Deluxe. I have Sim City Four Deluxe in my Steam library. I've opened it one time ever in my entire life, mm -hmm. back in uh, back in the days of a uh, of I think 2013, and it crashed for half an hour, and that is my that is how much play time I have in that game. Um, and I refuse to install it or play it ever again because like city sim games are trash, they're terrible. No one wants to play them, and if you do, there's like something wrong with you. You gotta have like a, like a, like a, like some like kind of masochist kind of thing going, because like that's seriously like the same thing as inflicting like bodily harm on yourself, as like a joke. You play that game to prank yourself. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. That was date um... me. <laughs> <laughs> I think I I think everyone got the gist of that. Yeah. My throat hurts. What? What from? Talking. How long was I talking for? Or were you talking that whole time? I was talking the whole time. No, I know that. I know. Yeah, don't worry. I know. You can ask Dash, who joined. And then I told him to mute, and I just continued to talk. <laughs> and now he's gone. That was about 25 minutes? That was 25 minutes. Come to my streams for more of that. But, like, it's two hours. I like the the you went from Belgium to Burger King to age to plugging social media, Rocky movies, politics. Forgets which nostalgia critic episode you were thinking about. Minecraft Pocket I... Edition on Kindle Fire to Doug Walker to economics to John D. Rockefeller to YouTube to Andrew Yang to buying cars to SimCity to dating you. I want okay, so Doug Walker and the nostalgia critic are one. Of the... <laughs> There's way more topics. Yeah, they didn't log them though. That dude, that dude was a freak. <laughs> oh, do I do the G? No, I've completely ruined my uh, relationship with this brand. Which Why? brand? G Fuel. <laughs> Why? Just because they put lead Just in everything? Just because they put lead. Listen, I don't think that. 
putting some talking about something that's on their drink, like on the label, should get you should burn favorite. any bridges. I mean, it's a feature. Right, favorite meme. It'd be like it'd be like oh, it'd right, be like if Fortnite you. like just you like just burn. burn bridges with you for talking about how they added lightsabers yeah. into their game. You're just talking about a like, feature that they added. Yeah. I don't understand the the whole. Shut up. Thing with that. What? Stop talking. <laughs> oh. <laughs> God, that's, I, don't I laughed too loud. I hope I didn't wake up a family. I hope member. you did. A 3 a.m. Mom's gonna like come in member. and be like, Mom's gonna come in and be like, You little loud. shit. I'm gonna kick your ass. You're too loud. It's 3 a.m. on Christmas Eve. And you're screaming at the top of your lungs. Just sitting there shrieking, not even speaking words. Pathetic. I'm going to cut off your internet access. And you're Just grounded. Stop. Yeah, I know I'm scaring you, but it's possible. He's starting again. I'm not <laughs> starting again. And it starts again. I'm not starting again. I'm not. I'm not talking about Belgium or anything. <laughs> <laughs>